LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. Okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. Everybody stay back. Let us do our job. Broad daylight. A crowded street. Now I've seen everything. C. Galetta. Layway receipt. Pearl earrings. Made out to Bank of Arcadia. Shell casings. These look like 32s. Sir, I'm Officer, Officer Phelps. What exactly did you on? see? I heard the shots. Uh, I thought it was a car backfiring. Uh, I saw a girl run at the shoe store. You want to take a look around now? The witness can wait, Cole. We've got the perimeter. All right, all right. Yes, it's a dead person. FN Browning, serial number 01138. Might need to run it by a gun store. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. Speak to the witness before homicide arrives, Phelps. If you think she's lying, don't be afraid to get forceful. Verbally, of course. And don't accuse her of anything without proof. Lawyers love that shit. And if you're sure she's straight up, try the general approach. See what you can coax out of her. You look like you were a big team. Now I have a much lower opinion of you. Uh, can I can I help you, sir? I'm Officer Phelps, miss. I'm here about the shooting. Did you know the victim? <laughs> he was my boss. Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage's first name? Everett. And you are? Galleta. Clovis Galleta. Do you think you could tell me exactly what happened, miss? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my boss, bursts in yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall. don't know who shot Gage or why. 
No, officer. A man is dead, Miss Galetta, and it's a criminal offense to lie to a police officer. I will take you downtown. Get out! Get out right now! Send in one of the other policemen if you must, but I won't say another word to you. We have the murder weapon? But no murderer. The girl saw it all, but she clammed up on me. We could trace the gun. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. You thinking what I'm thinking? Tate, maintain the perimeter. You know the way. You can drive. What did I tell you about going too hard on the witness? She's a store assistant, not a prisoner of war. Is that supposed to be funny? I'm just saying that sometimes you need to pour some sugar on these broads. A little bedside manner can go a long way. And since when are you the expert? We got the murder weapon, didn't we? You shouldn't dole it out if you can't take it, Phelps. She was a looker, though. Tell me I'm wrong. No wonder you're suddenly so obsessed with bedside manner. Are you drunk, mister, or are you just cracked? Cole, we got things to do. Officers, what can I do you for? Officers Phelps and Dunn, sir, Wilshire Division. We need you to trace a serial number. Sure. What's the make and model? FN Browning, model 1922. The serial number is 01138. You don't say. Well, I didn't sell it. Europeans love them, but it's pretty rare you find one over here. Although I did have one in here a couple weeks back. Remember the owner? Yeah. Kalu. Edgar Kalu was his name. Thing looks like he'd never been fired, but he brought it in here for cleaning anyway. Then he bought a box of cartridges and he left. Do you know where we can find Mr. Kalu? Told me he was on his lunch break. Said he worked at Hartfield's jewelry store just up on Broadway. Thanks for your help. You're behind the wheel. Officer, can I interest you in a new watch? Officer Cole Phelps, are you Edgar Kalu? Uh, no. Uh, Mr. Kalu is out back. He said he'd lie down. I'll buzz him for you. Son of a bitch! Go, Cole, go! Get back here! I can't decide between the tuna fish and the chicken. Too late, Kalu! Seen people 
like you, but I had to pay admission. Stop or I will shoot. Edgar Kalu, you're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage. <laughs> the case that makes you and the case that breaks you. The one you never solve. The one that keeps you awake at night. The case that gnaws at your guts and ruins your marriage. The case that keeps you propping up a bar as you relive the what-ifs, the might-have-beens, the half-leads and the half-truths. The case that other cops murmur about whenever you walk past. The case you never, ever discuss.